Hi, uh, Catherine Ottman here again, and I'm here to just give you a little demo on um, what you can do to make it safer for you with your blades. You can easily identify the blade, the sharp end of the blade, when you are picking it up. Um, what I do is I use uh, nail polish, um, and I you can see here this is the sh the beveled edge of the blade is the sharp edge. So you definitely won't, don't want to pick it up there. You want to pick it up from this side and hold it like this. So um, I take my favorite nail polish. This is actually the nail polish that I wear on my toes in the wintertime. And make sure it doesn't have to be and it doesn't have to be new polish. It can be old polish that you just want to get rid of. And then very carefully just put a little bit of it on the edge. Do both sides. Um, some people use um, they actually bake pieces of clay on the ends. Um, some people also do um, will also use clay along the top or some type of a guard. And uh, I don't like that myself because it limits to, it limits what I can cut. I always have to watch out for those clay pieces. This can go right through the clay if you have to. It won't damage anything. Um, and again, you want to do you want to do both sides. And once you're done, make sure you close up your nail polish so it doesn't spill all over the place, which I have done before. And then you can take your blade, and while it's drying, you can see that, while it's drying, just stick it in a, a piece of raw clay very gently and you can do this on the surface um, put it on your work surface is probably better but um, and then it's stuck to that so you just set it down there and let it dry and then you are done voila thanks for joining me